Hey guys, it's Starlos from Kirov from UnitLoss.com and this is a, I believe it's the second game in a three match series from the Zotac Cup between Baby Knight, love the name play, and Jimpo. Baby Knight is the nice purple colour, I think that's Kirov's favourite colour actually. <laughs> it is, I like it. I knew it. And then we've got Jimpo's the teal, um, off colour, not quite pure blue. It kind of looks like a cheap version of the mineral blue without the fancy glow. But yeah, and the map, the map is Metalopolis, which is, I do quite like Metalopolis, but yeah, it, it, no, I quite like it. I think this is one of my favourite maps, actually. I do like some of the new maps from the, from the uh, GSL, though, the massive maps. They are funky, nice macro games. You don't tend to get cheesy rushes, although actually, I believe the last one we cast had a cheesy rush on it. <laughs> yeah, so, uh, it. Yeah, fantastic. Occasionally you do get some loony who just decides, well... I'm going to go for a mad tactic and I'm just going to send everything in in a massive rush. I believe that's what Marine King did once on GSL. He went for a crazy Marine and SCV rush on, on this map. And uh, as far as I remember, it was not successful. I watched a couple of replays of him the other day. Um, I'll have to send you the link. <laughs> anyway, I think we're casting the game, not talking garbage. Good Lord. So... Uh, um, well, yeah, Baby Knight's chrono boosting out some probes, going for the bit of economy. He's just checked the top position, and uh, no, there's no Mr. Terran there. Jim Poe's lad's moving out the front, and it looks like he's going to scout opposites, which always makes sense because it's the closest distance, and you want to make sure your enemy is not spawning there, because if they are, there's a good chance they're going to rush you if they find out you're there. And it looks like Baby Knight is about to find out... Well, Jim Poe's going to see Baby Knight's probe, and he's going to know that he's not where his probe is. Yeah, Fast moves it straight back. as well. Off uh, Baby Knight. Yeah, that is a fast expansion. That is a very fast expansion for a Protoss player. I mean, he doesn't even have a gateway. What a crazy plan. I'm absolutely <laughs> I'm, loving it. I'm loving his work. A couple of Marines are coming out for Jimpo, and he's rally pointed him to the rear of his base, and he's moving him. Now, I was going to say, what's that about? Orbital Command has just come online. Orbital, Orbital Command. command got to make a quick exit. Yeah, there we go. He's yeah, away. he's away. He's away. He's just gonna. What's he gonna do with him? What's he gonna do with him? He's gonna bring him back home to mine. Mine another day. No, he's just gonna dance around the front of Jimpo's base. He's gonna grab the tower. Tell me, he's gonna grab that watchtower. I'm following him. I'm, I think he's going for it. Yeah, love it. Oh yeah. <laughs> Jimpo's seen the fast expand. I don't know whether Jimpo's ran up into the base now. Look, let's check it out. Yes, Jimpo knows that there's nothing in the base. <laughs> Surely, and the Marines are going out. <laughs> yeah, the second Rax has been dropped down. It's quite clear what Jimbo's going to try. He's just going to absolutely try and take him with a Marine rush. Well, it's not really a Marine rush. I suppose you could argue it's like a Marine timing attack. The bunker's going down as well. Well, is it a Marine rush form? No, it's not, is it? I don't know. Let's just roll with it. It's a double Rax attack of Jimbo. The bunker's gone down. Baby Knight must know the bunker's there. He just can't do anything about it. He's, he's got nothing. He's just got probes. The probes are. It looks like the probes are transferring. No, maybe he doesn't know. This is going to be quite bad. Oh, he doesn't. Oh, that, that <laughs> bunk, he needs to micro the Marine. What's Jimpo doing? Get him out of there, son. Get him out of there. Get him in. Yeah, he's going to make it into the bunker. Then probes need to evacuate ASAP because they're going to get butchered. Oh, that's bad. I don't know why what he's you, doing here. He's taking that bunker down quickly and he's got a zealot out. It's well not worth it. Why is he, why is he wasting all them probes on the bunker? Yeah. It just that's... doesn't make sense. With Is that another Rax? I know there's a factory down now for Jimpo. Jimpo has had to pull back sort of, but he's still got four Marines there against the zealot. They'll absolutely. Send the zealot to the filthy abyss, blow him away, fill him full of whatever the ammunition is. Full of, uh, full of, uh, uh, I don't know. <laughs> full of all nice stuff. <laughs> what the hell are we even going on about? We just don't know. Send us an email if you do. <laughs> so uh, the zealot is running away. Um, oh dear. More and more marines keep filtering in. What's this here? The marines, there's a hellion on the way. And There's a I'd, single sentry. He's going to try and force field that. No, he's not. No, he's not. <laughs> that was not a good force field. Way too late. Way too late. I think on this game, there's been a quite clear gap in player ability. I mean, Jimpo has absolutely... He, he scouted Baby Knight. He sees what he's doing. He's done the exact correct thing to counter it. And Baby Knight just... Well, I, it just looked like it was some kind of gamble. I mean, that Nexus is going to be lost. He's got one stalker... Uh, one stalker? One sentry in a zealot. The sentry's not even got enough energy. Well, it has now. It's got enough energy for a foot. No, it's not. I mean, about it's 50 energy for a force field. Yeah. So you can't force field the ramp. I wouldn't waste that bloody alien, though. I mean, Jimpo's in a commanding position now. I mean, he's fully mining his main base. His income is a couple hundred above. 
double the gas income, the production, we've got a warp gate, it's finally being done. Cloaking field, the banshee's being produced as well, which would just be <laughs> rub salt in the wound. I mean, he's in yeah. a real bad position here, Baby Knight is. It was, it was a gamble going that, that early for the Nexus, and it, I think on a map of this size, it, it would just never pay off. I mean, it's, it's big, it's a big map, but it is not big enough to really get away with that when you're against a Terran. It's all about reaction, ain't it? I mean, Jimpo, seen that, seen the expansion, straight away dropped down an extra barracks, started producing more marines, pushed on the expansion, wiped out absolutely tons of probes. Although the probe count is kind of equaling up, I mean, 23 to 30, but there's two mules down. The income tab, it just looks sickening. He doesn't want to look at that. That's bad for him. And the uh, the population tab, um, and he's, he's only 10 ahead. Well, he's, he's not 10 ahead. He's just under 10 ahead. Um... Seven ahead, I believe. Jim oh, the Banshee's gone straight in. Yeah, the Banshee's... Yeah, yeah, that's it. He can, he's got no answers to this. I mean, he can warp in units all he likes, but he's got no detection. He's got no robotic. Well, his robotics fill it. He's just finishing, but all the probes are going to be dead by the time... Well, not all of them, but most of them are going to be dead. They, they, yeah, it's all over. Yeah. <laughs> I knew it. That's what I was trying to say. You could have me out. Sometimes, sometimes... All over by the shot, and that was... Yeah, it was... It was uh, so it looks like Jimpo takes that game... And uh, keep watching because game three will be on straight after this. Subscribe to Unit Lost, uh, Unit Lost Tube. Check out UnitLost.com. Tell all your friends. Thumbs up for 1080p. Um, if you want us to cast a replay of yours, just send it to us at contact at UnitLost.com or contact us over YouTube. I'm sure we can accommodate you. Cheers.